you, man. Obviously, the dislike here is genuine, man. But uh, what, what do you think is going to happen come fight time, man? How do you envision Y'all know I take this shit real serious, though. As, as much as I say I'm really about everything I say I'm about, I mean what I say. And he know what it is. He's, he knowing it's hard what it is. He, he going to have to dream about this motherfucking shit. And I've been all about what I said I was about. And I've been proving it. My career has been a great career. And it's fine to be whatever it could be. I got to prove a point, he got to prove a point, and let it be what it is. And I'm fine with that, all right? So, all of the, the jibbing and the jabbing and all the little slugs that he throwing and all of that, hey, whatever I do, he going to have to do it, my bad baby. So, he going to have to live up to his word, I'm going to live up to mine. Do you think he respects you at all, uh, as, he a fighter, just me. as a I'm fighter? Sure, I, I promise you he respect me. He, I've heard it out of his mouth that he got a different type of level, on a different level. He knows it. You talk about the, you said his brother, or he ran into your brother, uh, and he avoided him. What does that mentally mean as far as where he's at? Man, trust me, man. He running scared of this shit, uh, like this shit real life for us. Like I said, this shit real lines only shit. Link up lines, where y'all at? I'm for real about this. I don't care what it take. Money don't gotta make us link. It's about our hearts and where we at to link up. How important is it to get a knockout just so there's no controversy at all with the judges? It would be great. It would be great to get a knockout, but he got to go 12. He will have to go 12. If he don't go 12, that means they're going to put 15 on it. I'm with it, whatever. You know what I'm saying? That little, that kid can't stand in there with me. I promise you. Not for real. I Y'all haven't seen them boxer come charging me down and bagging me up and putting no hurting on me. This ain't happening, dog. He don't got the skill set to do that yet. You mentioned something about the sparring, that he was not cut in sparring in the, in the press camp or something I, like I that? named it, y'all heard it. We ain't gotta go back and forth with it. If y'all was at the press conference, y'all heard what I said. Now it's up to him to explain that, what happened. I want y'all to go ask him what happened. Now that after all of that interview, yeah, y'all got him before I said all of this. Now y'all go back and ask these same exact questions. He let his city down, I didn't. I ain't let mine down. And I'm rocking with all of y'all too in LA. This is home for me as well. I just want y'all to know I'm for, 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 I'm for real about this shit. This, they took a, a fight, a, a loss. I mean, I got a loss on my record. That's what separate me and my brother. <laughs> That's mine, though. Yeah. I want to be different. Now, ask a question, What's though. the biggest adjustment you got to make in this fight? I know the last press conference you say you need to get off to a better start. Um, <clears throat> how, how you, what's, what's the big adjustment in this fight? I'm going to start this fight just, I'm going to end the fight just the way I started it. If he can handle the power and this pressure that I really got on me, I'm gonna release that anger on that motherfucker. Motherfucker don't wanna fight me, I'm telling you. Do you feel like he's trying- Hey, be careful what you tell them, people. Do you feel like he's trying to get in your head so it plays into his boxing can't, style? Can't get in my head. I'm, I'm one of the most happiest men. For real, for real, dog. Y'all, mm -hmm. let me tell y'all something. I'm really, really secure and content and happy with myself. I'm really in a way that I know what the fuck is up. To a point where I can able to, to have these things said. Y'all never heard him one time talk about what really, then y'all y'all wanted to see the fight. Y'all the fight fans that wanted to see this dude get in there with me again and prove why he won that belt. He never in his, he never explained to y'all what really happened in the June 23rd fight. He didn't have surgery. But if I would've did some shit like that, oh, hell would've broke loose. I'm out of town, right? Vada pulls up at the crib. Vada sends in a letter saying they haven't got been able to drug test the Charlos, but all, all of a sudden we are dirty. The fuck out of here. But I didn't I didn't did every Vada test that ever came. If I'm home, I'ma do the test. What's up? Welcome to my world. But the end results is some other bullshit, right? Mm -hmm. I've been a very solid person all the way around, but I'll just be quiet whenever they try to disrespect and clown and make fun of. They got to find something to talk about, man. And that's kind of what his his thing is. He got to get loud with y'all, but it's speak reality. Right now, man, the, the realest thing that ever happened, dog. But if that would happen to me and me pull out a fight, they would have wanted fucking testing. They don't want it all kind of serious shit going on. That's why I say what really happened. If you didn't, now he said he didn't get a clearance. I know all y'all, I know all y'all are here right now, but shout out to fight her for the interview that they did with him that I seen. I'm, I'm hoping to look at all y'all interviews and, and, and see if this, if, if y'all rocking legit. A lot of these questions y'all ask are against, but against me a little bit, but it's okay. I know it's great questions that y'all trying to get proof of, but let me tell you the truth right here with a, 
I've been rocking for a minute. But look, I gotta give it the real way. This is reality, bro. Y'all people come to my fights. Y'all sit up and wait on this time to happen. And y'all come to spend y'all time to make this work. But why did I lose the fight? Now I'm questioning everything. I'm trying to figure out why did I, how did, what did really happen? If, I, if everybody in the media and everybody in the world saying that I won, how did I end up losing the fight? And why do so many people, what they wanted a number two? I'm not the same like all these other fighters and coming in this thing. Now I'm coming in for the shits, the whatever. Y'all just amp me up and lit that fire. And y'all, they fed the ammo. It's a walking duck. Shoot him, quack, quack. <laughs> Jamel, when, when do you think the injury was fake? Right off the bat? Right off the bat. He was just hooping on his Instagram story. <clears throat> if y'all don't follow him or not, he was hooping. And then all of a sudden, the next day, he injured. So was it all a game plan? I honestly, to be honest with y'all right now, I just had this whole press conference. I didn't hear anything he said. Like, it's not that I didn't want to hear him. I was really trying to hear him, but I hadn't missed the beginning because my mind was on something else, you know, at that moment. I was literally thinking that coach, and I heard he say I, he talked to Derek and all this other shit. And I'm just thinking, like, who is really there for me? I ain't got to worry about who there for me. I know one man that is. It's the man upstairs. I'm going to get in there and I'm going to do what I got to do. And I don't got to, if they all against me, eventually they'll ride with me and they'll turn for me. But right now, when you call a snake out, you call him out, all right? It's the truth. I have nothing to hide, nothing to lie. Everything is what it is. I worked my ass out to be in this position that I'm in. I didn't get this shit handed to me. If, 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 to be honest with you, I shouldn't have made it in this position. I could have been locked up in prison forever. Some of the craziest shit that I'd have been involved in and seen in my life. But I took the right path in my life and did what's right. So I'm, I'm happy to be in the position that I'm in. And I'm not going to sit here and play these in and out games like this shit fake. It's a real life. And unfortunately, they got one of them real guys that's out there. They got them in this real boxing world. And I hope that I come in this real boxing world and change up things. Make y'all see what's real about this shit.